Cheers for those, Jim. Quick visit to France for a couple of races before the Breeders' Cup gets underway later. And we'll kick off with this Group 1. And the card, unfortunately, hasn't loaded, so they're all installed and ready to go. And away they go. And closest to us is the grey Lihu Mossa. And right over on the far side on the rally, it's Onwards and Upwards. Onwards and Upwards is now being challenged by non-blondes. Also going through now into spring into third place. Then being chased by almost three greys. The um, first of them is Arthur Guinness. But it's now Onwards and Upwards who's gone into a two-length lead from non-blondes in second. And then into spring he's in third. Arthur Guinness is fourth. And then comes Hathamore Pants. That one's quite wide of a truck looking towards the back fortune ahead is the back marker early on. They come past the seven firm mark there and onwards and upwards leading by two to three from non blondes in second. And then into spring is a clear third, virtually three sheer in third. Closest to us, half a more pants and the two greys. The one over on the far rail is Carmelia and the other one is Arthur Guinness with the green sleeves. Then also making a bit of ground now, Fortune Ahead is moving through from the back. Masharaf Emperor is the one that's widest now. Trapdoor Home has got some ground to make up and Lihu Mossa is the one who's struggling out the back as they make their way towards the home turn and onwards and upwards is three to four clear of non blondes who's a clear second ahead of into spring then arthur guinness trapdoor home is making it on masharaf emperor is making life difficult for itself by running particularly wide half a more pants has dropped right out of it leo mossa trying to get into it but it's onwards and upwards who's still in the lead but now about to be tackled i think by non blondes although that one's now taking a check back again the one that's really storming up the inside is leo mossa who was out in the back early on but onwards and upwards has kicked on for home passing the two leo mossa carmelian coming through as well mosha Raf Emperor has given up a lot of ground on the turns, but he's now making steady progress as they race down towards the final furlong. And onwards and upwards is leading by about a length, but Carmelian is really beginning to close. Makaraf Emperor running a big race on its own up the centre of the track. They're inside the final half furlong, and Lehu Moss has come chart. Charmelian's come through to take it up. It's Charmelian who's going to win it. Charmelian, the winner from Masharaf Emperor, might have got second. Onwards and upwards was caught, I think, and ended up only third. Then Lehu Moss was getting those two. Dan Hughes' horses mixed up because they both look pretty similar. And it's Carmelian that's won it. Carmelian the winner. For Dan Hughes, Masharaf Emperor for Daniel French, second. Oh, what's oh, Joshua Sutherland, third. Leo Moss and Dan Hughes, fourth. And Trapdoor Home for Darren Thompson was fifth.